In the broad world of medicine, perhaps no doctor has a more diverse or challenging practice than the zoo veterinarian. While human doctors deal with only one species, the zoo physician provides medical care for hundreds of different species. But thankfully, zoo vets can now depend upon a host of high-tech treatments and examination techniques that were unheard of in animal medicine just a few years ago. A prime example of this occurred recently when the North Carolina Zoo transported a female gorilla to the North Carolina State College of Veterinary Medicine to receive a CAT scan. Now this female gorilla has a tumor in, uh, in her vagina called a squamous cell carcinoma. Uh, unfortunately, because of the location of the tumor, it's not an operable tumor. So we wanted to evaluate the tumor, see if uh, this particular tumor was a candidate for radiation therapy, and then to go ahead and proceed. We needed to get a CAT scan. We've arranged to take this gorilla to the veterinary school at North Carolina State University in Raleigh. When she was anesthetized, uh, we intubated her, we put an IV catheter in her. She underwent the CT scan, and from that CT scan we saw that her tumor was actually much larger than uh, we thought it was, so uh, radiation therapy was really our only choice. If we got good response from the tumor reduction, we feel that we've given her a number of good years of quality life. So modern technology is enabling zoo veterinarians to solve medical problems that were once considered untreatable. If you'd like to learn more about the zoo's veterinary division, please visit our website at nczoo.org. Reporting for the Zoo Files, I'm Rod Hackney, connecting your life to wildlife.